So here again, we've got a chart that indicates a potential bundle of shelter and food. And we're going to compare this to other things. And this person, we're going to try and represent the preferences this person has. So the first assumption we make, assumption number one, is called non satiation that's the technical name the less technical name is just sort of more is better and that means that all else equal if you have the option between two different bundles each one includes some shelter and some food if one of those has more of both it's preferred okay so if we imagine taking this uh, allocation as our starting point we can divide the space up as such. And anything over here is less food. And anything on this side of the line is more food. Similarly, we can divide it in this way. Anything above that line is more shelter. And we've also got more food on this side. Anything, uh, and this is still more shelter over here. And anything below this line is less shelter. So, non satiation basically tells us that anything in this quadrant over here, where we have more food and more shelter, is preferred to this bundle. So I'm going to call this bundle, bundle A now, so that we have a name for it. So anything over here is preferred to A, because anything in this box here has more food and more shelter. Anything down here, in this lower corner, A is preferred to, because all of those bundles, everything down there has less food and uh, less shelter. What about these guys over here? We don't know. They have more of one and less of the other. And so we can't just say using this one single principle, which is better, okay? All right, that's non-satiation. 